Hello folks, Abfielder here, back with the next in my series of Tweakaroo Tweak videos, and today we are going to have a look at the Zoom functionality. Before we get into that, a quick apology. I didn't do any of the videos I said I was going to do after the last one. Very good reason, I caught COVID. Thankfully, the symptoms have been, well, they've been fairly mild. I have had the first jab, so that probably helped. But I have been struggling a little bit with a cough, which has made recording videos quite difficult. Hopefully, getting a lot better now, I'll be able to ramp those back up again. That being said, let's get into this video. So if you need to know how to install Tweakaroo, link will be in the top right hand corner right now. Assuming you've done that, X plus C will open the config menu. And there's a few things we need to talk about for this to work. So firstly, click on tweak toggles at the top, then click the search and type in zoom. Make sure you have this set to true. It's set to false by default. So if it looks like that, just, just click on it and then click there and there you go, it is enabled. Now you can turn tweak zoom on and off by setting a hotkey. You don't really need to do that unless you, I, I don't know why you would turn zoom off, but you can set a hotkey. Just Click in there, search for Zoom, set yourself a hotkey. Just make sure it's turned on. Okay, assuming that you're not gonna set a hotkey for that, we're gonna go into generic hotkeys next because this is important. As well as being enabled, you need to set a generic hotkey. So Zoom Activate, I have set to the C key. So if I just reset that, you click on here because it'll say none, then you hit the C key, then you click in a blank bit of space, hit the escape button a couple of times and you are done. There we go, and that is the zoom functionality. Now, it is really good. There's two things I wanna talk about here. One is you don't get that wobble effect that you get with some of the other zoom mods, which is quite cool. The other thing you might've noticed is I just zoomed out a little bit. How did I do that? Well, if while holding the key that you set it to, in my case, the C key, use the mouse wheel to scroll forwards and backwards, and then you can zoom in and out. And it is like so, so powerful. I mean, that's, that's the observer. So really, really useful. One last thing to note is if you zoom out all the way, because one did do this not long ago and wasn't sure how to fix it. If you keep zooming, keep zooming, keep zooming, there we go. The world will eventually flip upside down. So if this happens to you, then all you need to do is zoom in. You see the number at the bottom is going down and then it will flip back like so. Back to the more familiar territory. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you found it useful. If you did, hit that like button. Please consider hitting subscribe. I did put a sign there that I was gonna zoom in on that said subscribe, but uh, we're, too far, <laughs> we're too far away. Anyway, folks, that's all I've got time for. I'm Abfielder. Goodbye.